Hey everyone, this is Alex or Polymomoti and today I have a video showing how to make these rings out of those keychain rings and UV resin along with some other stuff that goes inside. So the major product we need are these keychain rings. If you don't have any, you can just buy some wire and make out some circles yourself, but I was too lazy. So I got some wire cutters and cut it in half and it just falls apart like this. And then you can use wire like benders or pliers. I just bent them with my fingers into a closed circle. And then I'm taking the two key rings and I'm just holding it together and wrapping around with tape so it covers the entire area. And next, using some scissors, I'm just going to cut off some excess tape just so it's easier to access the area between the rings. And I'm going to fill it up with some UV resin and cure it under the lamp. Once the UV resin has set, I am taking off the tape layer. And sometimes with the tape, it leaves like the adhesive on it. So the easy way is to take it off is to place some tape and just kind of snap it off of it. And it comes really clean like this. And personally, I wouldn't wear these rings because I don't wear stuff like that, but you can wear it if you just adjust the size of the actual rings itself. And so I'm going to take some UV resin and dab it on the middle of our UV ring and I'm putting this giant diamond crystal thingy that I have and let that cure under the lamp. And then I'm going to add some more UV resin on the sides and putting some little jump rings in it. Jump rings are really nice to add because they kind of work as like holders or placeholders for any other accessories you want to add. So I'm adding some UV resin inside the jump rings. And then I'm going to add some pearls along with some other little diamond thingies. And let that cure under the lamp. And then here is the first finished ring. It's very flashy. But that was kind of my goal, to make some flashy rings. So I wanted to do something floral, so I have these little flowers that I had from a previous Sophie and Toffee box. And I'm just going to put them inside the ring in the tape first. And I'm putting a, like a rainbow design to it, so slowly but surely I'm adding more and more flowers of different colors. After all the flowers are fully set, I'm going to place my UV resin inside the ring. And then remove the tape layer. Then I'm going to place some UV resin onto the middle. And that's so we can put our accessory. And I decided to put this crown on. And inside the middle, put a little pearl just to fill up the crown. And finally, I'm just going to dome the sides of the ring just because the flowers are still kind of exposed. And here is the ring with the flowers in it. And I really like how this one turned out. I thought it turned out really cool. So then for the next one, I'm going to just do regular UV resin inside the rings and let that cure and then take off the tape. And I want to do something simple for the third one. So put some UV resin in the middle. Next I decorated it with these little square studs and I put nine of them just to make it very simple and clean. I wanted to add more to the actual design but I really didn't know what fit well with the square studs so I just left it as it is. And you know, it's pretty simple and I think it's refreshing after like the two really flashy ones I made. For the final ring, I'm going to add these two little circular rings inside the actual ring. And then I'm going to place the UV resin inside and let that cure. And once cured, we're going to take off the tape. 
place some resin in the middle and we're gonna put on our giant flashy centerpiece which is this heart bezel thing I don't know where I got it from but I want to put that on and then I'm gonna dome the sides and add our accessories so a little star inside the gold ring and then just a little gem next to it and repeat for the other side and let that fully cure and here is our heart ring with the stars and jewels on the side so that is our fourth and final ring and here are the final product for all of the rings I hope you guys enjoyed this video there was actually supposed to be a fifth ring but it kind of broke apart as I was filming so I decided to just keep it at four but I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you all for watching